Hello, I'm Assad Ahmed. The lightship Greta, the boat being pulled by Extinction Rebellion protesters from the south of England to London, has been forced by police to run aground in Kennington. And this afternoon, as its journey suddenly ended, a protester glued herself to the boat. Thomas McGill followed what happened. A day of protest by Extinction Rebellion across the capital. One event here in South London, the lightship Greta on its way to Hackney, hoping to raise awareness of the global climate emergency. We don't really want to cause disruption. It's highlighting the ecological and climate emergency that we're already in the middle of. We're shining a light with a lightship, which is a beacon of hope on that dark situation. But shortly after chatting to Claudia, the protest was stopped. Well, the lightship Greta and these protesters say they had an agreed route with the Metropolitan Police, but in the last few minutes they've been stopped here in Kennington and not allowed to go any further. Around 20 or so vans full of police have shown up. Organisers say they're being told they're not allowed to go any further. The protest did end here and organisers estimate that over 200 officers were drafted in to help disperse the crowd. But Claudia was determined to make her point. Can you tell us what's happening? The police have uh, basically surrounded here. I don't understand on what basis. I know that we peacefully uh, walked all the way from Brighton and had police liaison and support throughout. That we've basically been conned about what we were able to do. Tell me through what have you done? I might have glued my hand to the, to the boat. Um, I don't want to move because I don't think this is right that, this, that our free speech is being impeded. Police say the organisers of today's march knew the Red Ship and its supporters did not have permission to enter central London. Those on the march disagree and say this move by the Met has been devastating. I can't believe it. I'm, I'm actually really, really emotional at the moment because I've, I've walked all the way from Brighton to be here to tell people about the climate emergency and about the people that are going to be disproportionately affected by it. As for Claudia, her day will end in a police cell after she was arrested. A busy day for police who say events like this put huge pressure on resources. And over this summer in London we've had many, many protests uh, and other activities that we've had to deal with. The Extinction Rebellion protests come on the back of that and put even further strain on policing resources uh, and bringing police officers into the centre of London where they should be policing their communities. The maiden voyage of the lightship Greta abruptly ended, its supporters devastated and its light out for good. Thomas McGill, BBC London.